Now we just have to know whether Barami's cut is uh, going to affect him in the next fight. Pakistan fire is a little bit slow, but he's standing his ground. He's not showing that anything, everything he's getting hit with is not hurting him. Now this is prop this is uh, the Pakistan's team's first major tournament that uh, they've entered into, and they're actually doing very well for for new fighters on the, on the scene. Um, each of the Pakistan fighters that have come across here are the winners in their tournaments in their regions. And, you know, they're taking great courage to get in here with some of these fighters of the level that, that is here today. I think what will happen is, as they move on in the levels, they might just find that the, uh, the pace that they're fighting is uh, not going to be enough to get them through into the finals. He's gonna do it now. The winner of this fight will meet Balami in the next uh, in the next level, and uh, that's gonna be a um, tough one. The level of conditioning that uh, fighters in, in this form of fighting have to have far exceed most contact sports. Not, mainly because of the reason is you, the, the blocking, you, you're, you're taught to take the kicks on the legs and that, so conditioning plays a large part. There's very little leg blocking. You see that see number 22 is starting to buckle from the leg kicks which I don't think this is going to go much further that's it I'm pretty sure it's finished the referee